Hey, welcome back. In this video, I want to talk about Facebook newsfeed targeting. It's different from the targeting that we do inside Facebook Ads Manager when we create Facebook ads. This is for organic content. So when you create different posts on your Facebook business page, for every post, you can pick the specific audience. Maybe you're posting something for just men or women, so you can define that and then eliminate everyone else from that post. And hence, this can increase your potential engagement on your Facebook business page. Let's jump into it. Let me show you how to do it. So here I am logged into Facebook and one of the business pages that I manage. So I'm going to go to the section called create post and let's just kind of create a new post. And by the way, one thing I'll quickly mention. So Facebook has been making changes to the layout of the platform business pages pages recently. So we used to be able to select our audience, the newsfeed targeting options right here. But now we have to go inside the publishing tool. So Another thing I'll mention, so by the time you watch this video, Facebook, who knows how many times they're going to change the platform. So if it looks different from what you're going to see in this video, do not panic, do not worry, reach out to me and I'll help you out. I'll help you find where the new options are because you never know, Facebook has been, you know, they change their layout so much, so often. All right, so let's get back to the video. So I'm going to create and let's go to the post scheduling additional options that are available inside the publishing tools. So we're going to click on publishing tools. By the way, they're also available right here if you look on the top of the page. But I'm going to click on that and now it's going to open the publishing tool. This is where you can uh, you know, basically create your content or for the images and videos for your page. You can schedule it, uh, all kinds of good stuff. Now, so once this loads, what I'm going to do is just click on create post again. And let's do a quick post. I'm just gonna say, you know, test post. What I wanna show you in this video is right here, these options under newsfeed. So I'm, when you click on public, so public means anyone on or off Facebook can see your post, right? But look at some of these options right here. These are very powerful. So one of these is the top fans only people who are your top fans. So if you think about this, let's say if you have 100,000 people on your Facebook page, but only 10% are engaged or top fans, you can show your content to only those people and they're already engaged. So what it's gonna do is it can increase your engagement even more because you're showing it to already top fans or more engaged fans, right? But inside this video, we're gonna talk about this option right here, which is the news feed targeting. So we're gonna select people in newsfeed with specific interest and their friends. So let's click on that. So this is very powerful. Newsfeed targeting, choose who should see your post. And you can do this for all of your posts, all of your organic content uh, on your business page. Now, one of the things that I like to do is, which I mentioned earlier, maybe you have a piece of content which just appeals to women. So if I click on women here, you'll see how the, the estimate reach or is gonna be 2,700. When I click on men, it's going to be 17 and all. It's a small page, so 4,400 people. But even though our reach is less if I pick the women, but if you think about this, if, you have a, if you're showing the right piece of content to the right people, guess what's going to happen? They're likely to engage and your engagement will even increase and it can even increase your uh, reach. Um, and the other thing you can do is uh, for this page right here, it's a a video appliance uh, store basically say electronics and home appliances and kitchen appliances uh, furniture store so what we like to do is sometimes uh, when we post something let's say if we're posting something and uh, it's to do with the the kitchen appliances so we might just select kitchen and you'll see right here how our targeting the the reach is changed right here it's 2600 people but if our content is about kitchen and we're showing it to people who are interested in like kitchen or kitchen appliances that's a very very good match that it's likely to increase our engagement so i wanted to show you guys and obviously you can also uh, uh define you know pick different locations that you want to and uh, languages so maybe you want to only show it to people who speak english so you can do that as well so by eliminating or by showing your post or your content to the right type of people you can increase your engagement because then you're not wasting the the newsfeed impressions or exposure on the people who are not really into that type of content or that type of organic post now one thing i'll quickly mention with anything that you learn in, in inside this video or from me or any other uh you know source on the internet i always say this hashtag abt always be 
testing. So whatever you learn, put it to test. The reason I say this is because this tactic works really well for some of the pages that I manage and for some other pages, it does not. But we can only find that out by testing it. Now, the other thing I'll mention is, so when we define the audience here, it reduces the reach, right? So if I, let's say, if I didn't have this selected, our reach is, let's say, 3,900 people. But when I add the interest kitchen, so it reduces the reach, the potential reach. But the powerful thing is because we're matching the content with the right people, the engagement can skyrocket and then it can balance out. Uh, and if you have more in engagement, those type of people, Facebook can sometimes even, you know, bring you even more reach because more re more engagement can bring you like more reach. So I wanted to quickly mention that. The other thing is, so how do you, if you've never done this before, so maybe your next like four or five posts, so test out the newsfeed targeting. And then once you have done it, go back to your post insights. Cause I like to test everything and then let the data, no guesses. Don't let me or any other expert just tell you what to do. Put everything to test. So once you have like posted, let's say four or five pieces of content, you can go, uh, we're gonna go back on the page. Uh, let's leave this. Cause I'm gonna show you where you can see the post inside for every single post that you have you can look at the insights and then determine so I'm gonna go inside the insights right here and let's scroll down uh, to a section so we're on the overview that's fine so scroll down it's gonna uh, you're gonna see uh, five most recent posts but I can also see uh, see all posts and then look at the data so what this section is now it's showing me the data on all of my content on this page so here's the the date published what the post is uh it's a you know in what the type what's the targeting and then the reach and engagement right so and i can also do engagement rate so let's say you've never done the newsfeed targeting before but you want to do it do it for the next five or six or maybe ten posts and then you can come to this section and look at the data and then see is it working or not? Is it really increasing R? You can compare the reach with the previous post. You can also compare the engagement with the previous post and really let the data tell you, you know, what's working or what's not. But this can be very powerful if you match the right type of content with the right people. It can really like skyrocket your engagement. Hey, one other thing I wanna quickly mention. So if you're not seeing on your Facebook page, if you're not seeing that option to do the newsfeed targeting, you may have to go to your settings and turn it on. Let me show you how. So here is one of my pages. It's a very small page, a new page, uh, my personal brand page. So on this, I'm gonna go to settings right here. And then we are gonna go to section called uh, general right here. Make sure you're on the general. And then you're gonna look for uh, audience optimization for post, this section right here. So the ability to select newsfeed targeting uh, and restrict the audience, right? So I'm gonna click on edit and then turn it on. There you go. So just wanted to let you know that sometimes if you're not seeing those options, the newsfeed targeting options on your uh, Facebook business page, you may have to go to your settings and turn it on. That's what I wanted to cover in today's video. Uh, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, uh, leave those questions to me. Uh, leave in the comments or send me a message. I will be more than happy to look at your question and provide my insights. Thanks again for tuning in today. I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.